Hi, my name is Phil Sewell and I'm a partner at Godfrey's Law in Christchurch. Only people who are well enough placed should be doing that. They may live to be 90, they may need the money later. Another risk that we see a lot of is that the money given to the younger people is perhaps poorly spent. Or if it's gifted to a son, maybe his relationship fails and the ex-partner effectively walks away with half. So some real risks there. Also, later in life, if they're going into rest home care, giving away money earlier in life can create big problems. WINS, which administers the scheme for paying rest home fees, is very careful to not pay the subsidy for those people who have deliberately given away their money. So if someone was contemplating giving away a huge amount of money, they would knock themselves out of that system. So small amounts, $27,000 per couple per year is acceptable within some time limits, but quite a few rules to be aware of. And so we've dealt with these issues for many families for many years. Lots of solutions, lots of ideas. It's not a case of one package fits all, so it's a matter of going through the options and working out what's best.